everyone welcome back to the channel and today i have exciting news this is going to be my third day until i am checked into the hospital video three more days it is now friday and i'll check in to the hospital on monday monday afternoon so i'll be in three days exactly it's 4 p.m here now i will be in the hospital and yeah, going over all of what's going to happen tomorrow. I have a whole list of everything already. And it's not going to be any big surprises. It's all written down on a big sheet of paper. And four more days, exactly at this time, I will be in recovery. So the next following day, uh, I will be admitted on Monday. Surgery will be Tuesday the 15th. And the surgery will be done in the morning. So I'll be woke up early at about... 8 or 8 30 or maybe earlier I'm not sure and then I think it's probably gonna be earlier and then my husband will be there so he'll be coming there from southern Kanagawa where we are at and so that's a big trip for him to go so he'll have to get there or leave six o'clock in the morning Eek. so he'll be there for my check-in my surgery day and then he will not be there for the uh, Wednesday and Thursday because Corona. So he can't be there for visits or nothing. Nobody's allowed to have visitors during those days because they want to keep exposure as minimal as possible. And then he will come pick me up on Friday. We will obviously be taking a, a taxi to the station and the station to uh, home, uh, we will get, I think, the green car. Green car, if you don't know, is a train where in the middle, it's usually in the middle of the train, there will be two sets or one set of green cars. And when you go to that area, you will find on this platform station, there's a little box and like, it's not little, it's just a box and it looks like a tr uh, recharge for your Suica, so your train card pass. And it's so then you can buy a green car seat. And so you use that, you put in where you're going and it will automatically say how much it's gonna be. You pay that uh, and you just get on the train. On the green car, you get a seat and you get a seat along with, there will be less people in a green car than usually on the normal cars because everyone usually goes to the normal car which is the normal cost but we'll get a green car and that means I can sit and relax because I might still be a pain I don't know everybody is different everyone who I've watched online uh, talking about their weight loss surgery they all would say something different or have similar stories so many people say oh it wasn't that bad at all some people say they didn't feel any gas pain they only had a little bit of a, a soreness to where they take the stomach out because it's a vsg so they take 80 percent of your stomach out at that incision point is the most tender so but a lot of people well not a lot but a few people did say oh the first day was horrible. I was in so much pain. And yeah, so I don't know what I will be. I hope it, it will be minimal pain. I know that this place is really good. This is the best place I think in all in, in Japan. And yeah, so that's my quick update. Three more days to go. I will do another video the day before. I'm ready to go. So then I'll catch up with you then.
is my room. I'm checked in to my place. Surgery isn't happening yet. We went through over everything uh, nutrition wise, pain wise. Uh, we went over a lot of stuff. We got here, uh, I think, 1 p.m. and it's now almost 5. Let's see. Yeah, you can't, I can't flip it around. But it's, yeah, quarter to five. And yeah, this is my room. It's pretty fancy. It better be because it's like $660 a night. So tomorrow's surgery, I will be getting all of this stuff done around eight o'clock or 8.15, possibly 8.30. Um, at seven o'clock, I'll have to put on uh, a numbing patch on my hand uh, because I'll be getting my thing there. I don't know if you can see it on one of my veins. There's still a dot <laughs> to where they did it last. So yeah, uh, that's everything we did today. He also got me pocket Wi-Fi, pocket Wi-Fi for <laughs> uh, the five days I'm here because <laughs> I need internet while I'm here and it's unlimited so thank you my hubby hubby for getting that for me he just ordered it online and it came to us by mail very quickly uh, if you do come to Japan look up global Wi-Fi I don't know if, there you go look up global Wi-Fi and they're great they're great for uh, getting really good priced internet for while you're staying. You don't have to get a SIM card, just get that and you'll have unlimited internet wherever you go, which is helpful. So yeah, uh, I will catch up with you later on. Bye. Hi, so I'm up. I don't know if I have this on right, it might be on backwards, but I'm up. I was up, woke up at 6.30 to finish drinking water at 7 and yeah I'm just waiting for the doctor and my husband to get here around 8 it's about quarter after 7 so this is surgery day and I'm uh, I can't believe it's actually here I'm a little nervous so uh, I probably look really tired because uh, I have to have my hair up as well. Um, I never get up this early, so yeah, let's hope. And let's see you on the other side. <laughs> Show you what I have every day for lunchtime. I have one of these, it has lots of vitamins and minerals in it that's supposed to be, help me mimic what I'm eating for that meal. I only have this once a day uh, during stage one, along with quiet fridge, quiet, and a drink 100% it has to be 100%, or these vegetable drinks that are also 100 and this grape one here so what we did and also jelly he got me the zero calorie and I don't eat the bits in it I just toss them because I can't have the hard bits right now uh, and jello so what I would have in the hospital was two drinks soup and jello so I'm about to have my soup and it has to be all within an hour. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. And that's another half of one. He got a zero calorie one. So yeah, that's everything that I am having for my stage one. Hey everyone. So this is going to be my update from since I got discharged from the hospital on Friday, uh, which was yesterday. And yeah, I will tell you what went on. Uh, pretty much the whole day uh, of surgery I was in and out of consciousness I was asleep most of the time my husband was there went in recovery thankfully they let you in uh, your husband or one person in the recovery area so he stayed with me and then 
when I was in brought to my room. I kind of remember that. Yeah, it was. It's just on and off blur. And then he couldn't come the next day because the corona rules. Uh, they said you could have a visitor for for about an hour, but it takes an hour to get there from where we we are from. So. It, it was just easier for him to stay at home because he was working. And Friday he came uh, early in the morning and picked me up. Uh, we got a taxi to Shinagawa Station. And there is where we got uh, the train. So I got in a little bit extra walking then. And yeah, then I got to the green car seat. Obviously I didn't want to stand. I'm not going to be standing for a few hours waiting just to get a seat. And so yeah, we got the green car home and then another taxi from home from the home our home station to home. And yeah, that was all of yesterday. I still have a lot of pain in one area where um there's two spots where he stitched my muscle and that's the first one on my left hand side is the hardest one. Like it hurts the most. And that's usually when I'm moving. I'm sitting on the chair kind of like lean back. It's like a, the back moves up or down. And so it's slightly back. So it's a little bit more comfortable than sitting straight up. But yeah, I I got the worst pain there. And I thought, oh, that's where the they took the stomach out. And they said, no, it was on the right hand side. And that's my second most painful spot, which isn't so bad today. But yeah, it hurts so that's all um, I had for my meals. I'm pretty much having juices, uh, natural juice with fruit and veg both in it. And last night, since the husband was, I'm going to have a few drinks, I was like, you pick me up 100% fruit juice while you're there so then I can have something fancy too. So it's a nice fruit juice, which I didn't even finish all of it. I ended up having to use... Uh, use about half of that and then I had my soup mixed with it so generally what I'll do since in the hospital I would have uh it depending on the meal one meal would be like for example uh a fruit juice and then there would be sometimes a second fr fruit juice I don't know what it was miso soup and what was the other one jelly and it was made from real fruit because you can tell when it's made from a real fruit jelly uh, over jello, which we can't get here. We can't get jello. So I can't get the sugar free uh, jello cheesecake, the pudding je cheesecake one. I really want to get that so bad because it sounds so good. But yeah, can't get that. And I was thinking about finding a way to make it myself. So I'll look around uh, or whenever the husband goes to the grocery store, you get. 100% uh, apple juice and I have some gelatin so I'm gonna see how I can make it myself here so that I can pull a portion out that I got a soup which is kind of like a really fancy kind that ended up being in a paste form not a powdered form and I thought it was a paste uh, I don't know I thought it was a powdered soup and it wasn't and so when I put it in the fridge it gets kind of hard like it's real soup it's not just like a fake soup. It has little bits of speckles, like not enough oil for you to, you know, for it to affect you, but you could tell it's an authentic soup made from real stuff. Yeah, I just put a little tiny bit in a cup and I ha I'll have that with my uh, drinks. So that's mainly what I'll be doing for stage one. My stage one will be up on the 30th and I'll start stage two on the 30th. And I can't wait for that. So then I can have onsen tamago, which is like a soft boiled egg that's even softer than water boiled. It's when you take it out, it's kind of like creamy texture, like not like a jello, but where it's not fully hardened. And so it's really good. It sounds weird, but it's really good. And I'll get to have tofu. Uh, sorry if we're doing dishes, so you might hear that in the background. And some birds. I think maybe. No, you can see. Because, um, yeah, I'll go get to be able to have silken tofu. And I will enjoy that. And I will ask to get a, a dashi soy sauce. So I can put dashi soy sauce on top. Dashi is like a fish-based soup broth. So it would be a dashi soy sauce. 
and that would be really good and there'll be other things I'll be able to have including yogurt which I will have some cocoa powder and some fake sugar so what I'll do is I'll just add that to it and I'll have a really yummy chocolate pudding kind of thing it, I've made it before it's really good yeah that's pretty much it I'm just get, getting through on my how many days this is Saturday so Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday five days since surgery and yeah I'm still in pain I can't really bend over very much but I'm doing okay so that's my update so far that's a long enough update and I'll let you know how I'm feeling on think day and I'll be doing my week weekly weigh-in I already did weigh to see how much I lost since I left the hospital and I'll be including that onto my what my final result for the week but since it's on a Wednesday it's going to be I had surgery on Tuesday so it's going to be eight days not seven so that's going to be my way in Wednesdays and yeah I will catch you that day coming up. Thank you.